The eruption occurred early in the morning, taking many visitors by surprise as they explored the park's famous Old Faithful geyser nearby. As the ground began to tremble lightly, several geysers... In an awe-inspiring event that captivated visitors and sparked scientific intrigue, Yellowstone National Park's old basin geysers erupted in a powerful display of geothermal activity. The eruption occurred early in the morning, taking many visitors by surprise as they explored the park's famous Old Faithful geyser nearby. As the ground began to tremble lightly, several geysers in the old basin area started to boil over, building up pressure before releasing a sequence of forceful eruptions. Columns of superheated water shot into the air, reaching up to 150 feet, while dense clouds of steam blanketed the area, creating an otherworldly scene. Park rangers quickly alerted visitors to stay back, urging caution as the geysers' unpredictable activity posed potential danger. Despite the warnings, many tourists gathered at safe observation points, mesmerized by the raw power of nature at work. Yellowstone's old basin geysers are part of a vast geothermal system that lies above a massive underground magma chamber, heating the waters beneath the Earth's surface. This geothermal activity has created some of the world's most famous geysers, including Old Faithful and Steamboat Geyser. But Old Basin often remains a quieter, more sporadic part of the park's landscape. Geologists suggest that this recent burst of activity could be part of a natural cycle of increased pressure and movement within the park's underground network. While geysers erupt on unpredictable schedules, they serve as a reminder of the volatile forces at play beneath the surface. Though no injuries were reported, the eruption did cause a brief panic among some park visitors. The sudden noise and tremors led to confusion, with a few people fearing it might be an earthquake. Rangers acted quickly to calm concerns, explaining that such eruptions while visually intense, are typical in Yellowstone and generally pose no immediate threat as long as safety guidelines are followed. Park officials have since closed off certain parts of the old basin area to allow geologists to study the recent eruptions more closely. Scientists will monitor the geysers in the coming days, looking for signs of continued activity. <laughs>